An explosion has uh, now been reported in uh, the Prashant Vihar area of New Delhi. Fire tenders have now reached the spot and more details are awaited in uh, this particular update. White powder has been found from the blast site just as the forensic team had earlier found it near the blast site uh, behind the wall of the CRPF school. Arzu Zait, my colleague, is joining us on the broadcast to give us more details about this. Arzu, if you're there with us. Yes. Arzu, what do we know about uh, this explosion so far? What are the initial uh, updates telling you? Uh, well, a blast was reported near a sweet shop in the Prashant Vihar in the northwest Delhi, the Rohini area. And injuring a man, this is what information we are getting in. Also, uh, you know, uh, the Delhi police have uh, received a call uh, at around 11.41 a.m. and uh, informing them uh, about the explosion in the, you know, white powder-like substance <coughs> in the park. And after that, the chaos was happening in the entire area. Uh, the, and after the information that got, police got, the fire tenders, the fire department official have also informed that they, uh, they got the information about a blast around 11.40 and following that there were four fire tenders uh, that were rushed to the location along with that you know special uh, uh, police force has also reached there according to the delhi police the window and the windshield of a park vehicle was interact after the blast indicating that it could be a explosion of a low quality they added that the terms uh, a team from the fire department bomb squad uh, crime forensic as well as the local police uh, are at this spot uh, you know so now the search is going on also it has been found that the white powder like similar uh, remember uh, we need you know on october 20 also a loud explosion uh, took place near the crpf school in prashant vihar the same area where today the incident has happened in the Rohini's uh, sector 14 uh, on 20th October also prompting police and the bomb squad to rush to the spot along with the fire brigade and uh, there also there was a white powder that was found and today also uh, at that uh, Prashant Vihar where the explosion has happened today there also a white powder the police has found. Yes, we need. As you stay with us, Mr. Ellen Rao, former uh, DCP special uh, uh, Department Delhi Police also joins us on the show. Mr. Rao, so what are your initial impressions of uh, what this means? Is, is this uh, uh, you know, something which can be construed as uh, some sort of uh, a one-off uh, lone wolf incident? Or considering the fact that there was an explosion in Delhi just a few weeks ago as well, uh, this could be something that would require more probing. Uh, Vineet, good afternoon to you all, viewers. And uh, this incident of uh, blast. Uh, because uh, it is also having some uh, white powder, white uh, uh, material, and in that uh, uh, explosive which took place a few, week, few weeks earlier near CRPF school, it seems to be the uh, uh, same, uh, you can say, same persons who might have created this, uh, uh, caused this uh, uh, explosive. And that uh, is uh, too early to say uh, because uh, the investigation is going on and the forensic team is at the sports so yeah, uh, and uh, other uh, special cell officers are there. But uh, definitely it seems to be a very uh, critical issue because at the same time, uh, the same location, two blasts, consi uh, consequently uh, that within a, uh, within a month period it has taken place. So uh, that uh, Delhi police had to uh, look into this uh, very seriously. And these persons should be apprehended. I don't think that in earlier blasts also there was some breakthrough. I, I don't think that somebody has been arrested in that case also. Now, uh, and this is uh, another uh, blast subsequently uh, to that, that really uh, uh, is a great concern for the security and safety of our uh, city. And mm -hmm. especially, it's, uh, it's a very challenging uh, uh, investigation for the uh, police to find out who are the persons behind it, what, they, what is their motive, and uh, what they want to uh, tell about it uh, while doing all this uh, these type of explosions no Mr. doubt it Mr. May Mr. Be Rao, what what kind what kind of uh, precautions does the delhi police need to take and what kind of elements do they need to watch out for in the next few days <coughs> the delhi police is uh, having all sop for that to stop all these things such things and the delhi police Delhi police is always uh, circulating the uh, uh, what is to be done and what is not to be done. That uh, all do and don't 
for preventive measures in, in such type of uh, incident to prevent all these incidents that is much more required uh, at the end of Delhi police officers and they all uh, they are also uh, making aware to the general public what is to be done uh, and uh, they are to prevent all these uh, uh, explosives now it's also uh, uh, on the part of the public uh, that they should also um, be well aware ear and eyes open and if they found any suspicious article, suspicious person roaming in that area, then uh, they should definitely immediately inform uh, the police, and uh, so that the, the, the uh, preventive measures or uh, the quick action may be taken by the police to prevent all these things. Yes, please. All right. Please. Thank you, sir, for uh, those insights. In fact, let me go back to my colleague Arzu as well. Arzu, if, if you've managed to speak to someone, what exactly is the police? What exactly are the authorities? looking at right now and are there any leads have they spoken to any eyewitnesses uh, you know what what is the initial impression of what really happened here uh, well Vineet, uh, the investigation is underway at the site of the blast in the delhi's uh, prashant vihar also the team of the delhi police crime branch special cell and also bomb disposal squad are present on this spot and uh, a loud sound of the uh, blast was reported near the pvr at prashant vihar area in the national capital uh, the official has informed the incident took place outside the bansi suite uh, after which uh, the you know the fire vendors were rushed and also the entire the police have cornered the, the uh, of the area and uh, the special uh, team of the Delhi police uh, has mobilized to the spot and uh, now they are searching, investigating, investigating the entire matter. And also according to the uh, sources, a white powder like substance has, have be, has been found on this spot similar to the what has been found in the CRPF school blast in Rohini on October 20. And also NSG team was uh, roped in to carry out the bomb, uh, uh, you know, da data analysis. And also what we are gathering is the natural agent, uh, investigation agency, NIA, <coughs> will assist the Delhi police in the probe of the blast. This is what we are getting to know. Uh, our sources are telling that NIA can also assist the Delhi police uh, in the probe of the blast because this is very concerning. This is related to the, uh, you know, uh, the security of the uh, Delhi people and uh, uh, while the, there was a press conference being held by the Delhi government or uh, the AAP convener Arvind Kejriwal regarding the uh, situation of the law and order in the national capital at the same time the new news of the blast have got uh, which is very concerning because in the past few uh, you know months uh, continuously there is a news of blast there is a news of gang war uh, so th that's why this is very concerning and now this uh, you know this is the second month in October also there was a blast in Prashant Vihar. Now this is in the November also such uh, information of blast that has come is very concerning and uh, also by, by this has been a you know deterioration in the law and order in the national capital and in fact now the Aam Army Party conquering the central government and the union home minister Amit Shah regarding all these issues regarding the law and situation in the national capital. Yes Vinay. Arzu appreciate you joining us. All right, to move